Hello LEGO fans, I'm the LEGO Box, and today I am here with the LEGO DC Super Heroes Batwing Battle over Gotham City. This set is unique, but it's not great compared to the old set. I'll show you some reasons. But first, let's show you the box. Here is the front of the box, ages 7 to 14, set number 6863, in 278 pieces. It goes under DC Universe, Superheroes, and it goes under Batman instead of Superman. Here is the that side of the box and that side of the box. On the back, you just have your little comic actions. And it shows everything. Alright, now let's get the famous one and only character board. Get that down. And then... Here are the characters. You get the Dark Knight Batman. You get the Joker's henchman. And you also get the Joker himself. So let's pull these minifigs out on the character turner. Here is the Dark Batman. You get him in. Alright, so you see he has a battering. Black cape. He does have the old mask because this mask has bigger ears and it doesn't make him look like he's mad all the time. He's got the black costume and he is double sided face. Double face. And he has back printing. The next character up will be the Joker's henchman. And compared to the old Joker henchman, this one is way cooler. He's got the clown mask, clown makeup, everything, a robber hat, um, the Joker's jacket, and I will show you, tell you why the joke, it's the Joker's jacket, purple pants, and this is why it is the Joker's jacket, because it has a picture of the Joker on the back. That, I thought was cool. That way, he, you know that that is the Joker Simpson. He is not double-faced. And here is the Joker. He has his little bang gun. I like the old Joker bang gun better because it has like a sticker. This one just has a flag. There's his front torso with a flower. And then his green hair and his makeup face. On the back you have the coat button. And you know, you see how it spreads. And then he is double faced as well. And I think he's double faced in all the sets that you get him in. As well as Batman. Alright, so that is all the characters. So now let's pull out the vehicles. First, you have the Joker's helicopter. This is pretty cool. It's got some funny things and some, you know, just regular things. One funny thing is there's like a little. This is printed. This isn't a sticker. It's got like somebody. Or a little round piece that has a smelly face on it. I call him Mr. Happy. Um, like in an uh, open season. And then you get the orange dot and you put it on him. Here's the front. I'll show you inside. You get these little operating sticks. And then the henchman sits right there. And then that is a printed piece. And then this little engine thing and some vents. On this side you get... The Joker sticker, it shows that this is the Joker's plane, and then you get some flick fires. It's the same on the other side, so I'm not going to go in detail on the other side. And I'm not going to push these, because, you know, they just flick. Um, down further, you get the Joker's little logo on the back. I don't know what this is called. I always forget. And then you get this little purple piece, and then you get, on this side, a propeller. And this red piece right here, if you push it, it releases Mr. Happy. And that's kind of it for the Joker's helicopter. Yep. And then, oh, wait, forgot the ladder. And you put the Joker right here. And these just snap on. You see? You see how they just snap on? It's kind of like the old Joker's helicopter, but this one just has one rope, not two ropes going down. And you have, like, a bunch of these. So that's it for the Joker's helicopter and got propellers. Three propellers. That's it. 
Now, the Batwing. <clears throat> I was a little depressed on the Batwing. <clears throat> it wasn't as big as the last one was. And it didn't come with a stand. So I was a little, you know, depressed. Wasn't really satisfied with the set, but it is a unique set. It's got some cool stuff. In the front, you have this little kind of glass. And the inside, it's yellow, not red. And then you got the wing right here. And then turn it upside down. Fire that wing. I can show you better if it's back here. The big thing. And then you have like those headlights. Here, let me pick it up for you. It'd be a whole lot better. All right. So here is the bat wing from the top view. That ever will adjust. All right. So you see, you have the wing, the flame in the back, and then the other wing. And you lift this up right here. It has this little thing. All you have to do is push it, and there's a bomb underneath it. And when you push it, it releases the bomb. And then on the back underside, there's where the bomb was. All you have to do is just stick the bomb right where it was. And it is right there. And this is the underside. You see it has some other flick fires over there and flick fire right there. And this is a big flame, not the small flames. And then on the underside, that's it on the underside. On the front side, there's really nothing. This doesn't pick up, but this one does. And that's it. 